Hello, my friends. Welcome to another exciting episode of Painting with Vanilla Biscotti. I am your host, Vanilla Biscotti. And today, today, I'm going to draw something a little different for you. Last time I drew Spider-Man, and I was going to draw Batman. And I was like, I've drawn a lot of superheroes in the past. I've been drawing a lot of superheroes recently. So, and I was going to draw something spoopy for Halloween, but I didn't want to scare you too much. So, today I'm going to draw one of my favorite Pokemon. You're probably going to be able to guess who it is right away. As soon as I draw this fin this part right here. No, you don't know who it is yet? Okay, well let me let me continue drawing here. And soon enough you will see who it will be. You know, I just gotta say I love drawing for you guys. I know you've heard this before. I love talking to you and I love teaching you new things. Sometimes, sometimes it gets hard for me to pick a topic to, to uh, talk about. So, a lot of the time I just kind of, I just kind of let my mind go and I just talk about whatever. I never really have a, a topic picked or anything. It's just kind of, kind of whatever happens as I'm drawing. Okay, so we got the base color, or the base down. So now we're going to start drawing some details here. This show is very reliant on user feedback. I always am looking for new topics talk about new things somebody might want me to say if you ever have anything you want me to t talk about on the show feel free to message me here or on Twitter oh, I'm going to graphically display my Twitter down below so you can message me if need be I've talked about bullying, I've talked about being a good friend, I've talked about what I think a good friend, what being a good friend means, just all kinds of things. And I've never, I've never really wanted this show to be really preachy or anything like that. It's mostly it's mostly my opinion about how I feel about things. And it's fine to have a different opinion if you you know, if I say something that you might not think it's necessarily true. Feel free to message me. I'm not one of these people that going to be offended if you say, hey, wait a minute, on this show you said this thing, but on this show you said this other thing. Sometimes it's good for others to give you a reality check. And, you know, me saying different things on the show, that's going to happen a lot because, well, this is a very popular show, and... I might say something different. I might say one thing. And then not knowing what I said last time, I might say something that contradicts what I just said before. And that's, you know, that's, that's going to happen. I'm not, I'm not here trying to, 
trying to pretend that everything I say is going to be 100% accurate. I'm just a guy, one guy, trying to teach people how to draw silly drawings. Sometimes my brain works faster than my mouth. My mouth works faster than my brain. And I might say something that you don't agree with. Let me know about it in the comments if I've ever done that. Let me know. Because as humans or aliens or whatever you want to be sometimes we just well we forget that other people are other people and and we especially nowadays have learned that it's okay to speak your mind in certain situations as long as you do it in a civil matter manner it is 100 percent okay to tell someone if maybe they hurt your feelings or something i tell people this all the time hey if i ever say anything that offends you let me know. Have I might I might have said something that you didn't agree with? Let me know. I this show cannot survive without feedback from the viewers. And your your opinions and values are very, very important to me. Once again, I'm going to graphically display my Twitter below. Just let me know if you ever have any questions, if you have, ever have any, any topics or anything you'd like me to talk about. If you have any drawing requests, let me know. I also sometimes do live streams of art. Not so much Lately, I've been, well, I've been under the weather, so that's one of the reasons why this video is a little late, if you are the kind of person that likes schedules, and I've just been super, super busy. Now, you might be saying, well, how can you say... You know that you're a good friend but then you turn around and say you're busy and I'm not saying that you can't be a friend and be busy because life happens and sometimes we get busy but you're never too busy to just hey friend how are you? Because even me sometimes I think man, I haven't talked to this person in a long time. Let me let me talk to this guy here and then I'll I'll take a little bit of time. And I'll send that person a message and, hey, hey, buddy, how has it been? How have you been? I've been busy. Tell me about what's going on in your life. I want to draw this little gun here. Actually, you know what? I think I will draw it over here but there's been times when I was like hey buddy how have you been 
I've been super busy and I apologize for being busy and I will I will just just catch up catch up with them you know and that's all it really takes even even if you're um playing you know you're sitting down you're gonna play your favorite favorite game oh, I haven't talked to Bill in a while let me let me contact Bill and see what he's been up to while I'm in the, the loading screen here and there you go you've you've once again contacted a friend that maybe you haven't contacted in a while and sometimes that's all it takes sometimes that's all it takes just a few a few seconds of your time and I think just add one finishing touch here And there you have it, a perfect Blastoise, every time. I'm glad you could join me today. I hope you learned something new. I hope my babbling wasn't too much for you. And hopefully I'll see you again soon, my friends. Take care, and I'll see you next time.